Hi everybody, my name is Dave Monahan, Goodson Tools and Supply. Today we're going to talk about our pistol grip vacuum tester, our DVC 2011. That's this little guy right here. We use it to, to confirm that our valve and our seat have a good mated surface. We can do that with a quick vacuum test. What we want to do is put 90 PSI uh, into our uh, gun itself. We want to hold 24 inches of vacuum measured on this dial right here. And to facilitate that, we've now included this optional hose kit as standard equipment. When you get your DVC 2011, that will show up in this uh, plastic uh, protective case. Uh, also, just so you know, we've got uh, options with regards to uh, different block off plates. We have a two inch diameter. We offer a three inch diameter. Uh, a two by three rectangle here, a three by four inch rectangle, as well as a big six inch, uh, do the whole combustion chamber on a big inch motor uh, vacuum tester, or the one that comes right into the kit with the extension hose is the four and three quarter that I can take like on this top fuel head and uh, do that whole combustion chamber at one time. Uh, we also include uh, this gel lube. Gel lube is real important because over time this is going to fatigue, it's going to get hard, it's going to get brittle because you've all got grease and oil on your hands, you're going to be touching this and that will just naturally uh, dry this out uh, over time. But with a little gel lube on there, we can work that back into the uh, uh, material, soften it up, make it a little bit more pliable and uh, uh, keep it uh, longer lasting out there in the field. So it's real simple to use. Get these out of the way here for you. I'm going to work on this combustion chamber here. Grab my air hose, quick connect right here, and confirm I got vacuum. I do. Oh, one other thing I want to let you know we create so much vacuum uh, with this unit. We have to incorporate a suck release valve. Yeah, I know it's not the most clever. Uh, industrial term that you've ever heard coming from me. My name is Dave Monahan, but that's what this is, a vacuum release valve right here. So when you're done, you don't have to try to wiggle this thing uh, off the workpiece. Just press that and release the vacuum right down the boulevard you go. But you can see with this hose kit on, it makes it real simple. I can keep the gun in my hands. I can pull the vacuum. I can read it right here on the dial, hit my release, and you can see I'm quickly off of that. I'll show it a little, one more time. Oops, sorry about that. There, you see how that pulled down here? I've got my 24 inches of vacuum. I've got a good seal in this combustion chamber. Hit that vacuum release, take that right off and away we go. Now, like I mentioned earlier, these, uh, these different block off plates, this three by four we have here, I can either get on the intake side or the exhaust side and check that uh, separately. So here I am on the exhaust side. I can pull vacuum there. It's looking really good. And on the intake side, I can come in here and take that whole port and uh, measure it uh, as well. So it, it gives me a lot more versatility as I work my way around uh, the different uh, cylinder heads and combustion chambers that are going to be in the machine shop. So again, it's, it's the DVC 2011. It's got an optional seven piece kit that you can get with it. It now comes with the hose extension kit and everything incorporates, of course, the quick release on and off of the different plates as you change those up according to the application you would be working on. So call 1-800-533-8010 uh, or catch us on the web at goodson.com. Thank you very much.